it's March, baby. We decided to take a little trip to Lucena. Um, it was rainy and it was cold and windy, but it was still super fun. Um, it felt like we were in a movie up there and everything was pretty magical. It felt kind of surreal. It was way up in the mountains. It was like an hour, maybe less than an hour <laughs> away, something like that. They had spectacular views. It was mostly just fog and mountains, but it was just cool being like in this little town on the side of a mountain. And they all have like little town halls and plazas um, and restaurants. And up there in Lucena, they were speaking Valenciano, not Spanish, very different. Um, and that was interesting, that was pretty cool. That was pretty much our Lucena trip. Uh, it was also Women's Day and they like, since you couldn't march, so since they couldn't do that, people were banging their pots and pans outside on their terrazas uh, to commemorate Women's Day. I thought that was pretty cool. We saw that on our like 9 p.m. walk around, uh, around the block. And, um, this week was FIAS, which is <laughs> honestly not completely sure what, <laughs> let me look it up. What is FIAS? All right, it's a celebration of St. Joseph in Valencia. Um, pretty much the gist, you just burn, pretty much burn the city down, like not really, but they make these like crazy sculptures and um, each like town or each, there's like divisions and they all make sculptures and they um, burn them. Whoever wins doesn't burn their sculpture, but everybody else burns their sculptures. Um, so the whole city kind of is set on fire. And um, so it's a very interesting, fascinating holiday um, that they dedicate kind of like a week to. But since we're in COVID, we don't get to celebrate it, which kind of sucks, because um, I would have loved to seen some sculptures on fire. And there's also like tons and tons of fireworks. So um, some people still did fireworks, but didn't really get to see that much. Uh, yeah, and other than that, uh, Valencia has been kind of kind of sunny. We had a really fun sunny day and you could just feel the energy of the city just like go up. Like everybody was just so happy to be outside and restrictions were lifted um, just a little bit. Yeah, so I thought that was really fun to see. There were people dancing and buskers all playing music and bubbles. I love bubbles. <laughs> And yeah, it was uh, it was fun seeing that. And we ate out and we had a really nice time. And then we decided to hit up a museum. I think it was the El Carmen Cultural Center. And um, it's a beautiful building that was, I think once a monastery and then a art school and now a museum. And they also had a special exhibit for Fias. So here you can see like some of the sculptures and things. Uh, yeah, so you could uh, see, I, I think like kids make sculptures, not kids, but like they get a group of kids to help put together a sculpture. Um, so those are the sculptures that were on display. And then you can see in some pictures that they had up that like they burned them, you know? So it's kind of like traumatic to see kids like playful sculptures, you know, just being lit up on fire, but Valencia is into it, so so I'm into it. <laughs> um, but yeah, it's a really cool holiday. I just wish that I could have been here to see it. And yeah, but the actual like Fias days, I think there are like three days of Fias. Um, I mean, there's a week, but the three days of it are important, I guess. And um, those three days, it was raining and like cold, so. Um, more incentive not to celebrate and like go get COVID. But um, yeah, it was raining. So I took a walk in the rain and it was 
pretty pleasant. Um, yeah, kind of refreshing. I saw a Faya sculpture. Um, yeah, just one though, because <laughs> nobody did it this year. It's kind of too bad, but other than that, I've been working at the print shop and I'm still doing this book project, which you'll soon see because it's almost done. And uh, I just took a test at school. Yeah, life's good. Things are, things are great in Valencia. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, so that, that was pretty much, that was pretty much a week. That was a week. So I will see you sometime else, I'm sure. <laughs>